First, I'm going to cover how you can create and send a quote to the customer while you're with the customer or very soon after. Firstly, we can come into Quotes, select New, and we're going to create a quote from scratch. So you can see here we have an automatic number in sequence for our quote number, and then we have a quote customer and an existing customer. A quote customer is someone that we have not done business with before. So if you want to quote someone there and then, you can simply select Quote Customer. If it's an existing customer, someone that we've done business with before, we can simply select existing customer and select our customer from here. From here, we can just start to allocate further information like the date and the quote heading here. We can also add a description of works. And what we can do from here is we can simply select on items and the green bar at the bottom here. And we can just start to fill out the actual quote. So again, we can write in a description, enter in a long description as well as a quantity, as well as a price. From here, this will calculate our net as well as our total. So from here, I can save the quote. To send this quote out straight to the customer, I can select on the three dots on the green bar here and I can select on the email icon. As you can see, it's automatically got my quote template at the top, as well as the person who I need to send it to. I can also attach any attachments from my phone, whether that be a photo or any sort of document. And at the bottom here, you can see we can edit the subject of the email as well as the body. If we want to preview the report of the quote, we can do that also, as well as sending the email straight from the mobile phone. Next, I'm going to cover how you can turn a quote that you've been given the go-ahead to into and send that into a contract within the system. So if we've been given the go-ahead to turn one of our quotes into a job, we can do so by clicking on the quotes icon here, selecting on the list icon here and from what we can do we can just pick on the most recent quote at the top select on the three dots in the green bar at the bottom here and we just select on the third icon to the right what this is going to allow us to do is just turn the quote into a contract as you can see here we can create the order and what that's done is it's just created the quote into a contract By clicking on the save icon at the bottom here, we can now save the quote as a job. And we can just start to fill out some information like the order number here, as well as any special instructions. So from here, I can simply click on save. And again, that's now saved the quote as a job on the system here. 